That sound confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars, ready to begin seeking the sands of past life. A successful landing for NASA's Mars rover. After Perseverance flew hundreds of millions of miles through space and survived its seven minutes of terror to get to the red planet. So this is a great experiment to see if we have humans that are set to Mars, how can they actually live on Mars? Helped by NASA Ames of Mountain View, which provided the heat shields for landing and a cool new helicopter aimed at bringing a little bit of Mars back to Earth. We're actually going to store samples of the Martian soil and then we're going to bring them back to Earth so that the scientists here can actually use our massive laboratories and equipment to actually do the scientific tests that they want to do on that soil. The historic landing was streamed all over the world by NASA and the Chabot Space and Science here Center in Oakland. Ames. Now the rover begins its hunt for signs of life. There are instruments on this rover which are designed specifically to look for signs of past life on Mars or even possibly present life on Mars. Among the upcoming experiments, trying to convert carbon dioxide from the Martian atmosphere into oxygen. A helpful step if we are to someday take a trip to Mars. At the NASA Ames Research Center in Mountain View, Scott Budman, NBC Bay Area News.